だよ<笑>、うん、So、uh, I just wanted to make these videos for some just to see oh I, I made a someone left a comment about responding to black pigeon speaks or some video on trans stuff and I made it like half an hour video that I don't think I'll upload it because half of that half an hour video was just me pointing the camera at the screen so it's only 15 minute response and it wasn't really that good of a response for me and I just don't feel like getting to this whole thing it's just so depressing arguing with these people but if you're seriously interested in the research just uh, you know some of those references black pigeon speak sites are you know the, there are responses to them, so if you're seriously interested, just Google it, and you will uh, find like people have written responses to some of those claims. I'm just very really tired of this. <laughs> uh, I'm just trying to just. I don't want to deal with this bullshit, transphobic nonsense. I'm just so tired. Uh, anyway. Uh, anyway, so um. Another thing is, uh, <laughs> I posted a video on Vimeo and like, I don't know, I, I, yesterday I, 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 I didn't plan it or anything, I was just like, hey, I'll just make a video and I just posted it. Be <laughs> all naked and stuff. I don't know, lots of people, I, I get all these likes and from the like Vimeo. And, uh, <laughs> On my emails, like, oh shit, another person liked it. It's like, what the? It does give me a bit of an ego boost, I must say. Um, <laughs> I don't. Okay, so acknowledged. Um, uh, but uh, so. <laughs> um, uh, so, but yeah, I'm not feeling too well. I'm you know, feeling a bit low and depressed, um, so I'm not doing too well. Um, just try to take baby steps, deal with this depression, low period, whatever it is. Um, yeah. So yeah, I thought I'd just mention that I'm not doing too well. Uh, <laughs> But you know, I'll try and just, I don't know, just deal with it. Uh, yeah. Anyway, so nothing mad else to report. Um, Things I, I did buy like a yesterday. I bought like a bottle of Jack Daniel Black and, and a pack of smoke, and I was like. Ugh. Don't do this. I'm just like, like nah. I don't feel like drinking. I, I, I only drank just a little bit. Like, yeah, it's like, oh shit, this is very strong. I don't think my body can handle alcohol. That is, uh, is <laughs> I don't know what it is. So I'm not gonna go down into a, tr a drunk spiral. And definitely smoking. Yeah, like yesterday I smoked half a cigarette. Today another half. But uh, that's really bad. I, look. I have a fear that I might get anal cancer, you know, so I'm always like worried I might get anal cancer because I've got a hemorrhoid problem and like these past few days I've been eating like, I don't know, this TMI, you know, spicy food like like chips, like uh, potato chips is, is, is spicy and whenever I eat spicy food or herbs or anything it always aggravates my <laughs> hemorrhoids. Um, so. Anyway, so, and then the fact that, you know, I had, I smoked these few cigarettes and I'm like, I'm, really, I'm getting, oh fuck, I'm gonna get anal cancer. And that's like one of the worst. <sighs> fuck. I, I, I was seeing a do documentary on that Canadian um, euthanasia law thing. And apparently one of the people who wrote in support of that law, she, she was like, she, she said she suffers from... She suffered from anal cancer, and but her cancer was in remission. But 
And I was just looking at her, and she, she looked like a very professional woman, like someone, you know, she's like in the like, mid 40s or whatever. She looked like she really, you know, really, I don't know. She looked like she was a professional, you know, and and she was like, she was advocating for euthanasia because I can imagine like like how she's feeling. I mean, I can't really imagine, but you know, because you know, cancer is not only are you, is it painful, but it's also the whole undignified way because of where it is and it's like fuck you know it's like <sighs> so anyway <sighs> god i don't know man it's all just fucking shit <sighs> yeah i think i might read that case uh that euthanasia case canadian case I'll make a video on that because i think it's important you know have euthanasia laws and stuff. More progressive laws, anyway. So I've got all these worries and uh, I don't want to get cancer. That's what I always think about. It, smoking is like cancer. So. Even if I just smoked a little bit, like half a cigarette, it's like one drag. I mean, I don't know. Who knows? I might already have cancer. I mean, you know, oh, I don't know, I haven't had any, I mean, I have, I have, I have had, I've had like colonoscopy done three times <laughs> in my life because I've had this hemorrhoid issue for a while, so they didn't find any cancer then, but, you know, anyway, so, um, So yeah, I mean, my plan is to just try and take my take care of myself, have a really work on my diet because my diet is really on it. It's my moods and all. Just if I if I fuck up my diet, my whole day is like ruined. It's like, uh, um, what else? Nothing much. So yeah, yeah. I don't know if I'll apply for disability. I I really don't know. I'm just like. But I'm not, definitely not feeling good. I don't mention that. There's no. There's no. It's okay. People feel low. Whatever. You know. um, anyway. Yeah, I just want to take care of myself, my diet, try to do exercises, and work on my voice. <laughs> That's something I definitely want to do. Uh, Later. So yeah, I'm not gonna upload that video I made Black Pigeon Speaks for it's just stupid. I saw the videos like oh god. If you're seriously interested in the research you can Google whatever and you can find resources. I'm just can't be bothered. Anyway. Yeah, I don't feel like uploading that video because I don't want to get a copyright strike because half of that video is just me looking at playing his video. So fuck, I don't want to get a copyright strike here, so and you know, I was I I made that video like on the 29th, like when I came back, and I was like, where, yeah, yeah, when I went when the job, the jobs, when I changed my job, employment agency. So I think I was I was having a little bit of a Jack Daniels, and <laughs> yeah, I wasn't really in the mood of making video, but you know. Mm.